Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome again to Savage Gaming and uh, uh, another episode of Forest. So, I'm a little bit peeved off because I made two episodes for you guys. The one episode I didn't turn my mic on, which is now the second time, and the other episode I did it halfway through. So, basically, just to update you guys, um, I built a, a big log cabin there where the airplane was. It did glitch out, uh, and then I figured, you know what? I want to. I want to build a houseboat so I want to go and uh, build something um, that I haven't built before and that I don't often see being built so I thought I'd, I'd build one and see if we could get it around so this is the the next installment was sort of based on building this houseboat we got chased by mutants um, we pretty much got haggled the whole time but eventually got this thing built built uh, so there's the houseboat, we can steer it around, I've built a dry rack inside, I've put some meat on it, so that's cool, um, so that we can, yeah, definitely uh, survive for a few days. So what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to get a few more um, birdies, uh, some meat, I want to get some feathers as well, uh, yes, 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 oh, I got it, okay, so get some feathers, get some, uh, get some meat as well, oh no, I don't want that. Um, just so that we can build some arrows, hunt deer if we need to get some more meat. But I think we're going to mostly rely on turtles for meat um, and birds. So, and that's not too difficult to do. But I want to explore around this island. But I want to do it sort of on the ocean. So, I've built the houseboat. On the houseboat, I got one water collector. It hasn't rained for like almost five in-game days. So, when I built this log cabin. It has not rained once. It's dry as ever. So I can't, I don't have any water. I've got nothing. I've got no alcohol left because I've been surviving on alcohol for five days just to get this this, this cabin built, uh, this houseboat. So I've done what I can. I've done everything that I think I can do for this. Uh, we've got a we've got two little pieces of meat now. We've got some deer skin. I've built arrows. Uh, I've got nine arrows and we've got a boat. So... I'm going to see quickly, uh, maybe we can spot a deer and get a deer to to help us out here. Just on the meat front and the skin front, I would like that a lot. But I'm just going to run in a little bit. If I see nothing, I'm going to, I'm basically going to run out. So let's have a quick squiz around here. I don't see any deer close by. Hey, okay, no, I don't see any. Take a few sticks. Sticks are always handy to have, and I think we're going to need some rocks because we're going to need to build a campfire on this houseboat. That's the only thing I haven't done yet: uh, is build a fire or a campfire so that we can cook our meat. And I think we're going to need that, especially if we're going to stay on this boat. Otherwise, we're going to have to carry enough resources to be able to build campfires uh, in other places. So here we go. Got our dry rack in here. I'm gonna put my campfire just yeah. So let's do that quickly. Fire, uh, fire pit. Let's pop it just yeah. Yeah, as I thought, we're short of rocks. So let's get a couple more rocks there. We only we only need two, so we should be okay. And it's just been really, really. It's been it was it was uh, two tough episodes, but. I got through them. I was just I'm so irritated that the mic was off. But it's not the end of the world, guys. We are here. We've got our lifeboat, and we are going to now venture out on our great sail. So, without further ado, I've never built a lifeboat, never sailed one, never tried to. So I've got absolutely no idea idea of what I'm doing. But my my sort of plan was I want to go up this north coast area here. So let's see if we can get it done. So okay, there we go. I've got to do that. How do I do this? Um, okay, I've got to turn it. Okay, I'm turning the houseboat. Okay, so that's sort of a pretty much works how you, you can walk and stuff, but you have to sort of I'm constantly holding in right so that I can just turn the boat, and then I think I let go once I'm aiming in the direction that I want to be in. And it'll go in that direction. There we go. Oh, awesome stuff. So now we've got meals on uh, on the water here, guys. We've got a, a raft game.
can't see much, especially on the left. But let's see what we can find on this journey of ours today. So I have I have done uh, bases on those islands before. Um, that's that's pretty cool as well, but uh, it takes a lot of grinding in terms of you've got to transport everything on a raft, you know, row back, row there in the morning. Um, risk getting attacked by mutants, so it's a little bit risky. I've done it before, but I won't suggest it uh, long term, but it is something cool to do. Let's just have a look around here. Oh yes, this is where all the electronic parts are littered. And I think I, I think there's a letter in one of these containers as well, which gives us uh, some hints to the story. But I want to get around here. Let's see, are there any movements around now? I don't see any, so we might just uh, jump off and quickly go get some uh, of those electronic parts because they help us create those, um, those bombs and so on. I can't remember what they're called now. I have to look in the book picture. Here it is. Yeah, all these boxes. Okay. So I think this should be. Yeah, this is deep enough to let go. It's still deep enough so they can't get to us. Uh, I hope. Yeah. Okay. Cool. So it's perfect. So we'll swim onto shore quickly. Let's grab what we can. These boxes here, are the ones we can hit. And let's get some of that stuff. We've got some turtles. We can get some more meat. Yeah, baby. Get some more meat. Need more meat. Okay. Right. Grab it. There we go. Oh, no. Just picked up a rock as well. Don't want that. Got a little bit of blood on us, I think. Yeah, was it? Yeah, the letter's in here. Yeah, it's like a... Uh, like a passenger list or whatever it is. Okay, so let's get more of these um, parts because we're going to need these things. Okay, we killed two turtles with one shot. Then. No, we killed two things with one hit. But be that as it may, let's get the rest as much as we can. Hello? Oh, shot over there. Oh, we've got some flares. Oh, what do we get? Oh, we've got some booze. Yeah, babe. So if it doesn't rain, we can still survive another day. Yes, that's what we need. Okay, um, I think the other thing I want to do before I go any further is uh, what is it? What is that? I think, yeah, I want to scour for some booze. I think there's some lying over there. We've got to get some more booze, guys. There we go. All this booze can help us make Molotov cocktails, and if we, if our character gets thirsty, we can. Ah. Oh. Yeah, if our character gets thirsty, we can at least uh, hydrate him with that, although it does drain your stamina. Okay, cool. So I think we've got all those things. What is this? Laptops? Can we... Ah. We can break up laptops. Oh, I'm getting lots of booze here. This is awesome. Break some of these laptops up. There's a tennis ball. I just hope I don't get attacked while I do this. But anyway, okay, we've got, a, we've got the maximum amount we can carry. Booze-wise, we can still carry a bit more by the looks of it. Yeah, look. Yeah, is it? No? No, okay, I think we've got maximum. Okay, so let's head back to let's head back to houseboat base. Uh, I think we get up. Yeah, we get up over there. Awesomeness. Let's put some stuff on our. Oh no, I don't want to put a leg on my dry rack. But I can put our dried out legs and use the crap. Let's just put stuff in. Right, let me put up all our meat. Yeah, we have. Okay, we've got enough to build another water collector. I wonder if we can... 
Get on top here. Hey, yeah, we probably can, eh? We can build stuff up here. It's maybe a good idea. Thinking about it. Build like a stick collector and a log collector and we can keep stuff there. Uh, was that water in my boat? Anyway. Right. Let's do this, guys. We are going to row, row, row my boat. Gently around the island. Avoiding lots of danger. Getting to cool places. So, I'm hoping we find cool sort of looking stuff that we can sort of go off to. It's not too far from shore, so that's that's pretty much what I'm hoping for in this episode. Seeing as though the others have got shot in the foot. Okay. I'm getting scared. This looks pretty shallow. I mean, I can see the bottom. And I mean, we quite far from the shore. Maybe this is just like low tide or something. <laughs> Okay. I see some nice trees there in the distance, and there's obviously the mountain area. Let's see what else is on the shoreline here for us. Oh, don't see anything. And then these little stick things on the side here, that, that actually often give some cool stuff. Well, those, uh, you know, mostly, I think in the last episode they've got players, um, but sometimes there's protein bars up there, and yeah, pretty, pretty decent stuff. Okay, there we've got a mutant in the distance. So maybe we should take him on and if he hasn't got... Oh, no, he's got buddies. Okay, he's got lots of buddies. By the looks of it, he's got two so far. Let's see. They are standing there on the shore. There's three of them. I wonder if we should take them on, eh? What do you think, guys? Do we, should we take on three mutants? I think we should. Eh? Get some bones and... Oh, there's four now. Oh, okay, now, but I'm starting to have second thoughts now. <laughs> Taking four of them on. Another one's run up there. Another one. It's like seven of them. Wow. What do these guys want to do? Are they trying to predict where I'm going to stop? Or? It's strange. I don't know if you guys can see them, but they're right there. Sort of uh, where my character's looking in the middle of the screen. Um, they're right there, and they keep seem they seem to keep running every time I get close by. I'm wondering if I should try and take them on. Hello, my mutant friends. I'm scared of the water. Hmm. <laughs> Sorry for you guys. No luck today. I am, ooh, there's a camp. Oh, baby. I bet we're going to find something cool in there, eh? And I think we take it on, it's like, uh, what's it now? It's like midday, I think. Let's have a look. Where's the sun? I'll find the sun. Hello, sunny, sunny. Okay, there we go. It's not that late in the day. I wonder if we should take them on, guys. I know they're going to tell their friends that we're here but that doesn't bother me too much because we're in the water we're pretty safe and that's why we built our houseboat and we can take on these sort of sideway bases all right let's 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 row a bit closer to shore I think that's going to be or closer to that base I should say it's very slow eh? I suppose it is a big house so. I mean can't be that easy to pedal this thing around there Sure, there's something in that base, man. Okay. I think we're close enough to shore. Let's do a turn around. Turn our house around because I want the entrance facing the shore so that if I do need to make a quick run for it, I can get quickly back onto the houseboat. And I see we need some food as well, so I'm going to have to cook something as well for us first before we do this. Okay, there we go. We're facing shore. There's our little steps. Nice. Okay, let's light this fire quickly. 
gonna have to cook a bit of food because I see our hunger is down pretty low. Okay. I think I'm gonna cook two pieces. Are they still there on the shore? Or they run. Or they run off to. I don't see them. Okay, tummy's full. Did not like that. Whatever that was that I cooked. But anyway, let's have some booze. Oh, no, wait, sorry, wrong, wrong button. Okay, so our, our thirst's back up. We are ready to rock and roll. Is that a lizard? No. Okay, there they are. There, there. Ah, this one's right here by us. Oh, and he's one of those stick dudes. He's like hard to kill, apparently. Oh my goodness, there's a whole bunch of them. Hope they don't start throwing stuff at me. Hello. Can you see me hopping on my houseboat? Ah, oh, maybe, look, you know what? Let me take my arrow out. <laughs> Maybe I can shoot them. <laughs> I got you and come on, stand still. Who's next? You wanna take one? Take one for the team, but take one for the team. Ah, oh, I just missed him. Keep still, man. Jeez, like guys. Take a shot. Take one from the team. Oh, got him. I actually bounced off him. That bastard. Oh, he's obviously got armor on him. Though. I'm like wasting my arrows now, but anyway. It's fun. It's fun, guys. Let's see. Yeah, I got him. Yeah, baby. Run away, run away. Go tell your mother. And you, you want one last one, eh? Oh, why can't I hit this dude? He's such an ass. And you came back for more, witch. Hmm? Yes! At least I got him once. Sheesh, took forever. How many arrows have I got left now? I don't think I got any. <laughs> okay. Well, that's not the end of the world. But uh, actually, I wanted to try this club out because for some reason I crafted this thing. I can't remember crafting, but it looks pretty scary. It's just this one, two, three, four, and I see one in the distance. Ah, and there's one running on the hill. Okay, yeah, I don't know if I can take these guys on. Eh? It's going to be a bit tough. And the sun's going down, so I also don't want to risk that. So I'm thinking maybe we'll just wait till morning. We'll see if they hang around, yeah? So if they come in the morning, we'll, we'll we'll try to take them on further. We'll jump in the water, grab our club, and see what we can do. Because this thing does apparently quite some decent damage. So, yeah, I think we'll, we'll call, it a, call it a night. We'll call it a day for now. And uh, I'll, through the magic of editing, um, I will fast forward to the next morning, guys. So, see you then. Okay guys, uh, it's now morning again, but uh, looks like these guys are relentless. I mean, the whole night, there must have been about 15 to 20 of these dudes here. It is so weird, they just, yeah, they, they're not going to leave me alone. And I, no ways, um, with my one piece of armor, I'm even going to try and take on these guys. So, I'm going to have to um, move my boat a bit. Because there is no way I'm going to take these guys out today. It's just not going to happen. I'm going to go a little bit more up shore. Uh, see what else we can find. Um, it's just these guys just don't... They won't leave me alone. Or they won't stop standing by the houseboat. So that makes it a tad difficult. So I'm going to go a little bit up, sh up shore. To see what else we can find.
Um, it looks a little bit safer here, but I don't want to chance it. You know, it just looks a little bit risky. Yeah, here we go. This looks alright, like a decent spot, eh? Hey? We'll catch some birds, we'll get some turtle. Uh, yeah, I think this is pretty good. Let's turn our boat a little bit. Might be a little bit close to shore there. Just going to turn this tad for us. And we should be good to go. Yeah, but all right, let's do this. Okay, so hopefully none of them have followed us. We are now going to try and see if we can get back to shore. Do a little bit of exploring. Whoa, that's way too shallow. I walked there. Okay, I'm going to steer my boat out a bit. Because <laughs> if I can do it, they can. So I've got to make sure that my boat's far out enough so that they can't swim to it. Oh, they can't. Yeah, there we go. That's, oh, crap. Okay, there's one. Let's take him on. Only one I can handle. One. You know? Come, buddy. Let's fight, my friend. Okay, he wants to run away. What are you doing? Like telepathically chinning your, telling your mates to come find me? Or, come. What are you scared of? This guy's pretty tough. Okay. Die. Okay, let's chop him up for some bones. Because I want bones to make bone armor. Chop everything off I can. Limbs. I think we've got enough here, guys. Hey? I think. Oh, that's his skull. Okay. I'm going to head back quickly. Just put these things down. Because then we can burn them on our fire. And uh, get bones out of it. So we'll quickly wash the blood off as well. Okay. Let's relight our little fire here, which looks like it's not going to last very long. But anyway. Let's put these limbs on there. Okay, I think we've got all the limbs out. Yeah, we've got all the limbs out. Okay, great. Any more guys around? Nah, yeah, don't see any. Looks like we're pretty good. Let's see if we can get some more limbs off him because... Yeah, I want to get that bone armor, so I want to... Definitely get some, some more bones. Let's see. Can't get that other... Ah, there we go. Okay, I've got the other arm, that's awesome. Right. I'm going to venture here a little bit, see what's up. This looks like it could be a potential cave. No, not a potential cave, but a potential fishing spot. Let's see if there's any fish here. Because that's fresh water coming down. That means there's a river up there. Which means we can fill up our deer skin and actually get clear water rather than have to drink alcohol to stay alive. Ah. This looks good. Can we drink this water? Is this water drinkable? No, it's not showing that it is. But it can't be seawater. What's this? Ah. Let's take that. I can see fish here. Suitcases. Lots of suitcases. Well, how am I going to get them out? What the hell? Oh, there must be a log with that. There's another base right here. Okay, that's cool. What's this? Ah, piggy, piggy, piggy. Nice. A purple pig, that's awesome. 
Okay, cool. We've pretty much got what we need. I think we're going to take a swim, get back to our houseboat. And then I think we're going to call this episode an episode, guys. Let's call it a day, and I'll see you on the next one. Cheers, dudes.